I'll show you how to turn on debug logs for Salesforce. You go to setup and in quick find box you can type debug logs. You come here, it is under environments. Uh, first, uh, you have to create the trace flags. That means it's configuration to dump the um, uh, debug logs. You have to select uh, you automation automated user platform integration user Apex class or trigger. I'll select uh, user for now. Yeah. Uh, my name is Everything J. By default, it's uh, set for 30 minutes. Debug level is a this is a, a SFDC control. This is the um, out of the box. Uh, it has workflow info, validation info, callout info, Apex called finance, Apex profiling. Visual for the info, system info, database info, wave, uh, don't worry about wave, it's from uh, or remnant of the old uh, features. It's uh, Einstein, NBA, uh, don't worry about that. But if you want to find us, so like workflow and everything, uh, you have to create a new debug level. You click new here. Uh, I mean, uh, finest logs database the finest workflow the finer validation info call out finest apex finest apex code finest visual for finest debug finest wave finest nbf finest you save it right uh, review all messages. Debug level API name can only contain underscore alphanumeric characters. Uh, yeah, I have to name be. Uh, I have to name it without spaces. Finest logs. Okay, I set it. I do some operations here. I go to uh, app sales then go to accounts let's create an account One 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 uh, triple A. So rating uh, hot. No parent account, and we'll save it. So I just created uh, an account. Let's see um, what we have in debug. We have to refresh to see the latest debug logs, and I click the. You can type F1 or just refresh. So I have the debug level finest here. So these are the um, debug logs. Yeah, the, you can delete debug logs as well. This is how you turn uh, on the debug logs and um, also create a new user trace flags it's a configuration to dump uh, uh, debug load depends on the your level you know how to turn on the debug logs you know how to turn the user trace flag you, you have to create a you know how to create a new user trace flag okay you can write below that you, you see debug logs you get debug logs. you can delete all the unwanted uh, debug logs here click the uh, 
it delete everything